Y'all, Paul Pierce need Alcoholics Anonymous. He need AA. He is a drunk in his clearest day. He is a drunk beyond measure. I don't know if he was a drunk like this when he was playing, but the brother loved that yak, okay? He about to have them yellow eyes like Michael Jordan. Look like he about to transform, dog. He about to look like a reptile by the eyes in a minute because the way he loving that yak and is making people, that he making himself look crazy now. It's funny for people to laugh at, but really though, it's like, bro, you out here looking crazy. If you don't know, if you don't know what I'm talking about, um, Paul Pierce was on Kevin Garnett's show. Kevin Garnett got this uh, basketball show on Showtime, right? And it's getting he doing he doing well, man. KG is transitioning to a great professional. I mean, he was a professional in the basketball lane, but we always knew him for being a guy who started stuff, always talking crazy, always cussing every other possession on the court. And all of that type of crazy stuff, right? We knew KG for just being wild as hell. Now he has his own show. We did, we getting to see a different side of KG. Uh, he's even mended things with Joakim Noah after telling Joakim, and I quote, to get off his dick while they was playing because Joakim came up to him while they was playing the Chicago Bulls and KG was with the uh, Boston Celtics. Joakim was trying, trying to tell him how he grew up watching him, how he loved watching him growing up, and, you know, how can he teach him this move that he did, and how did he do that move, and KG told him, get off my dick, okay, <laughs> right, so from that time, Kevin Garnett, since his retirement, he seems to be a real mature adult, right, and as a mature adult, you know, you want to put your homies in a professional light, get them certain looks, to get them a bag in certain ways. So he brings on his teammate, his fellow teammate, championship from a championship team. Boston Celtics legend Paul Pierce. Paul Pierce come on there, dog. He on there. He not he not knowing they're live. No, nah, I don't know. He might he knew they he might have known they was live recording. I don't know. Right? He might have known. He act like he don't know, but I don't know. He on there, he introducing Paul Pierce introducing KG to some girl he with, and he say, This is my girlfriend for the day, right? He tells them they got this little website where you can get a girlfriend from the day. So I'm I, I'm I'm on that. I'm on that. And I'm like, yeah, bro, like what the heck? Right? And KG telling him, hey, look, look at the game, man. Look at the game, man. Chill, chill, look at the game. He trying to tell his man how like, he got a girlfriend for the day. And I don't know what else about to come out of Paul Pierce's mouth. What is he going to say his girlfriend for the day, him and his girlfriend for the day going to do? I don't know, right? And so then he proceeds to talk about some other stuff. And then he asking for a lighter. He trying to fire up a cigar. He trying to say, what a, what a lighter, what a lighter. Somebody throw a lighter at him like a goddamn football, like Peyton Manning threw the damn uh, lighter. I don't know. Peyton Manning, goddamn Tom Brady, Drew Brees. And he don't even know which. He's so gone. He off that yak. He don't know which way the goddamn lighter came from. He's snapping out, hey, dude, don't make me smack you or something. Like Bro, it's KG like, man, cut it, cool out, cool out, dog. It came from over here. It came from over here, right? And before he even asked for the lighter, I forgot. He out here saying the N-word. He out here talking about something. He about to say mother effer on camera. I say, yo. Then it, from that point on, I think about his appearance on um, I Am Athlete. He got the drinking hand and just talking about, you know, you know, I had girls around. I mean, we was blowing, about to blow some tree. I don't know what I did wrong. You're recording yourself and you work for Disney, bro. There's morality clauses in these contracts. You can't be out here presenting yourself in certain images when you work for certain corporations. It is what it is. K, he, I mean, KG, I'm talking not KG, Paul Pierce, he don't know what he doing wrong in no situation. Got the yak in hand at all times. I'm like, bro, he's a drunk. And I know, K, I think Paul Pierce might have been married for some years, recently divorced. And sometimes when brothers get divorced, they let their hair down. I'm speaking metaphorically, right? They let their hair down. Um, and um, they just started to be, they started to be so re uh, relaxed. And they start having a time of their fucking life. He got his feet kicked up. And, and I think he is going down a path, a little destruction a little bit. Don't be out here smearing your reputation in your image. I'm not saying you got to be so dressed up and buttoned up and pristine at all times. Hell, like, you're a person, you're a human being. But I think Paul Pierce is one millisecond away from doing this shit on national TV, like on Showtime. Not on Showtime, like, Showtime, not national TV. But from doing it, like, he might make an appearance on FS1 or something like that and do this. You know what I'm saying? Or he might be messing up potential bags for himself because they're looking like, nah, dog, he a little too. He don't know how to stay professional in certain elements. He don't even got enough respect for his homeboy to say, look, I'm on my homeboy stuff. He got a real professional um, setup. I should be chill. I should be cool. Yeah, he getting toe up, getting wet up. 
probably before coming on that goddamn platform and having KG looking like, yo, looking crazy. K like, yo, listen, man, we trying to do the game. Listen, listen, man. Look, it ain't time for all that. He really trying to get him to be cool, man. Like, and he ain't going to say that on camera. He ain't going to get on his head. But I'm sure off camera, he going to be like, listen, Paul, don't be out here making me look crazy now. You know what I mean? I didn't. You know, polished up my image in a way. I'm, I'm, I'm looking real good on TV, talking my talk. You know what I mean? And presenting myself in, in entertaining fashion, but it's, as, at the same time, professional. Don't come out here looking like we get on some goddamn janky promoter shit. Don't have us out here looking like we rinky dink. Don't have me out here looking crazy like you on the block, getting lit up in, in, in California and LA. That you, it's a, it's a time and place for everything. And Paul need Alcoholics Anonymous. Seriously. Brother out there, like he about to, he's slurring, he's slurring his words all in KG face when he talking and shit, bro. If you don't back up, <laughs> hey, hey, what? Remember Smokey where uh, Craig was high and he got all his, uh, Craig got all his Smokey face. Hey, I ain't with that gay shit, dog, <laughs> right? Like, look, that's, he all up in goddamn KG face talking. That's what brothers do when they drunk, all up in your face. Like, bro, relax, dog. Your breath smell are like probably nothing but yak and ass. Cool out, because I know you and Camille about to get into some special extracurricular activities after this. But, bro, if you don't relax, bro, chill. Seriously, bro, that brother is out here. I don't know. <laughs> he, 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 he might be a yak monster like Michael Jordan. They might have something in common really, really well, dog. Seriously, man. Yeah. <laughs> but if Paul might have them hepatitis eyes in a minute. I did, Hey, he might be on the verge. But he really, really, somebody need to tell him about how he looking out here. He looked like he just like, like, looking like he been retired 20 years. Just, just out here just looking like he just be off the yak and just drunk every time he come around. Like, that ain't a good look, dog. You don't want to, you don't want to be presented in that light. Especially for how you were. Like, it looks like you would think the roles reverse Because how people perceive Kevin Garnett on the court, he was just, you know, he talk a lot of crazy shit cussing and acting a goddamn ass on the court, acting a fucking fool. But outside of that, he's professional. Paul Pierce would seem to be the, the guy that was professional, more, more professional. He would take light jabs here and there. But now outside of the court, he seen to, it's flipped. He don't give a he don't give a fuck. He just out here just whatever, whatever. Like he's yakking hand. Don't know what he doing wrong at any turn. Looking like the drunk uncle. In every situation, we looking like bro. Why is you coming up in here like Ned the Wino? <laughs> why, why, why is you up in here looking? I don't know. What is going on? He probably, liquor probably coming all out of Paul's uh, Paul Pierce pores. For real, like, ain't, ain't, there's no telling. But I'm like, yeah, that brother needs to go to AA and chill out and get an intervention, dog. Hi, e Ianla, come, <laughs> come out at Paul. Tell him get his shit together because he's looking crazy out here. Y'all know I ain't lying, man. You can have fun, and I have fun, right? I don't smoke or drink, but you know I have fun, right? But certain's a time and place for everything, and some people don't understand that. Paul, don't have your mans out here looking bad. KG got his professional thing going on. You out here, <laughs> hey, hey, hey. You know, says we need to, we need to <laughs> all in his face. You know what I'm saying? He's using the N word and mother, f <laughs> all type of crazy stuff. Hey, hey, hey. Like, like, man, cool out. <laughs> Cool your hostile ass out. You have to fight the man. Hey, dude, don't make me smack you. <laughs> Paul, he might, the dude might have whooped your ass because you look like you wet up. Like, you just, I don't know. God damn it, you more wet up than a goddamn seal right now. Okay? Than a dolphin, dog. It's, just, it's, it's crazy. Machiavelli Mills TV, I'm out. Peace.